Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? It's Big Porky here, the voice of hardcore boxing. <laughs> well, I'm pleased to say that I am now back to owning 100% of Porky's Corner. Well, it was only going to be a matter of time before I flew solo, on it? You see, the thing is, I want people around me that have got balls. That's what I want. People with balls. I don't want people dictating. I don't want people editing. We don't want that at Porky's Corner. We want people with balls. That's what we want. Massive gonads. People that are not frightened of taking it just that little bit further. We don't want to be like everybody else, all these YouTube YouTubers that are walking around with shit on end of the tongue. Shit. That's what they're walking around with on end of the tongues. God knows what they rinse their mouths out with. They must have shares in TCP. Let me tell you this. I'm not happy today, but I want you to listen to this. This is what I said in a video on September the 23rd called Porky Raw and to the Bone Part 2. Right, it's about a thousand views on it. And it's got a picture of me in a blue Lacoste t-shirt with Dennis Hobson in a casino. Right. Now later on in that evening, quarter to four in the morning, Charlie Giles left that casino. And uh, he was driven back to his hotel by a friend of ours called Martin right it's on the video if you watch but apparently I said something that's not gone down too well so what I'm going to do I'm going to play you what I said and uh, you can tell me if you think this is out of order all right here we go whoops two seconds I've got a bit of a technical issue <laughs> Right, go. Old Charlie fucking Giles there. Hey. <laughs> Old Martin. Old Martin. <laughs> Old, Old Martin, eh? Lumbered with taking Charlie Giles from casino back to hotel. Probably via a brothel. <laughs> Probably via a brothel can mean anything. Well, let me tell you this. If Charlie Giles or the British Boxing Board of Control have got a problem with what I've said, take it up with me. Alright? Email me. PorkyCorner at mail.com Alright? Let me repeat that again to the British Boxing Board of Control and Mr. Charlie Giles. PorkyCorner at mail.com no capital letters all lower casing get in touch with me and I will send you my reply alright now can I just state that Charlie Giles is a 75 year old family man he's never been to a massage parlour stroke brothel in his life and he never will alright when Charlie Giles goes to shows and stops out in an hotel. He goes back to his hotel. He goes back to Kip. He don't go. He don't get up to any any stupidness or any foolishness. He's a family man, so it's been took out of context. But like I said, if uh, if I'd have said Charlie Giles has been driven home via police station, you know, up, up that certain road, does that mean he's going to go into the police station and grasp somebody up? No, it doesn't. But whoever the little, little clever dick is who's caused this little bit of an issue, I hope you're pleased with yourself. I wonder if it's the same person who reported me to board for saying that Gavin McDonald should pick up the phone and let's talk. I wonder if that's that same person. Makes you wonder, doesn't it? So all you people from Boxing Border Controller watch my channel. Keep watching. Because out of the 100% of the people that watch, 44% of you don't even subscribe. <laughs> but you keep watching. So keep watching and don't forget the video 
is staying up all right the video is not coming down if i want to say charlie giles goes back to his hotel via a brothel that's up to me in it that's my opinion but if you remember i said probably now probably is not good enough so I'll keep on trucking keep supporting boxing all right now a lot of people have emailed me regarding this after the, the actual video went out saying that charlie giles is a freeloader he's a sponger he's been milking the system for 30 40 year now i can't testify to that any of that so i can't comment on that but what i can comment on is this charlie giles comes to dennis's shows and he gets checked right now if i've let dennis down i apologize but I'll make my own way in life. Dennis Hobson don't pay me a wage, all right? He don't pay me a wage, all right? We may do a few things together, but I don't take any money off in regards boxing. Now, if you've got a problem with me, you take it up with me, you don't take it up with Dennis. He ain't responsible for what I say. I'm a grown man, 49 year old. Take it up with me. No good having a go at Dennis, because all you're gonna do is penalize Dennis's fighters. All right, and his shows. Take it up with me, Russell Hartley. R U double S E double L H A R T L E Y. Email porkycorner at mail dot com. All right. Keep on trucking. Keep supporting boxing. All right. But remember, watch out for Charlie, because <laughs> he's coming to a show near you. All right.